Good morning, second graders. This is Mrs. Herman Sater, and I'm going to work with you on our phonics for today. So we're going to take a look at our new lesson for phonics. And today we're going to work on the O, O, and U vowel sound. And it's the O, O sound as in the word book. B, O, K. Okay? And we're going to talk about the different ways that we spell words with the O, O, and the U. Sometimes vowel sounds do not make the short or long vowel sound. This week, we'll be practicing the following spelling patterns. The OO and the U. And the OO, like I had said before, makes the U sound. Both of these spelling patterns make the U sound. We're going to click on the picture below to hear the sound. Okay, so the letters OO can make the U sound. So let's name the picture and then try to spell it. So this is a picture of a hook. How will we spell the word hook? H-O-O-K is the correct spelling of the word hook. If you have a whiteboard or a piece of paper, you can take a look at these words and you can write the name of the picture using the OO sound. Or you can just follow along looking with me. So if we take a look at this first picture, you see that it's a picture of someone cooking. So the word is cook. K -u -k, cook. And so even though we're hearing the uh sound, it's spelled with two O's. And cook rhymes with book, and it's the same thing. We're hearing the uh sound, and it's two O's for the spelling. So b u k, b o o k. This is a picture of a football, and football is spelled with the double O's again. F u uh, ball, football. If we take a look at this page, the letters U can make the U uh sound. So let's name the picture and then try to spell it. So if we look at this picture, it's supposed to be a picture of a bush. B -u -sh. So actually, before I scroll down, let's talk about how it's spelled. So bush, B -u -sh. It's B-U-S-H. And again, if you have paper or whiteboard, you can do this with me. This is a picture of a person pushing a cart. So our word is push. P-U-S-H. And you hear that uh sound in there. Pull. P-U-L-L. P -U -L -L. Okay? And this one is a picture of a jug of sugar. Sh-u-g-r. So it's the O-O sound, but these words are spelled using the letter U. Let's see if we can spell these words using the correct spelling pattern. This is a picture of a brook. br u and the correct spelling would be B-R-O-O-K. This is a picture of an octopus. An octopus is spelled O-C-T-O-P-U-S. So we would use just the U for the octa. That a uh sound is with a U for octopus. And this is a picture of a foot, foot, and it sounds like a U, but it's actually spelled F-O-O-T. So some pointers about this spelling pattern. When you're unsure of what pattern to use, write the word using each pattern. Then see which one looks like a word you have read or seen before. Then, 
Lastly, you should erase the word that looks wrong. So a lot of this is trial and error, which means you need to kind of practice and get familiar with some of the words to try to figure out if it's spelled with the O-O or if it's spelled with the U. And let's take a look at a few more words to practice. So which word is spelled correctly? Wood and wood, O-O or U. And it's actually this one, the O-O-D, W-O-O-D. And this one, let's look for the correct spelling on this word. The word is shook, sh-uk. And it's this one with the double O, sh-uk. This one has the word hood, h-u-d. And it's also the O-O. This word is stood. And again, this one would be using the O-O. This word is crook, which rhymes with that word brook that we looked at earlier. And when we spelled brook, we used the double O, which, we're, what, which is what we will do with this word for crook. So the correct spelling for crook is C-R-O-O-K. Couple more. Which word is spelled correctly? The word is good. And we know that good is spelled G-O-O-D. Another one is the word bulletin. And the correct spelling for the word bulletin is this one with the letter U, B-U-L-L-E-T-I-N. This next one is the word pudding, P-U-D-D-I-N-G, and it's spelled with the letter U, P-U-D-D-I-N-G. And this one is the word crumb. Which one looks right to you? Crumb. And it's this one with the U. C-R-U-M-B. Okay, so today your practice is going to be on this uh, page. And what you're going to do is you're going to take the circles and move it over the correct spelling once you look at the pictures. So this first one, what is this a picture of? It's a picture of a jar or a jug of sugar. So now you have three choices. You're going to take a look and see which one is the correct spelling for the word sugar. And then you will place the oval or circle over top of it. Okay? Take your time and work your way through a lot of these we did in the video um, already today. So hopefully you'll remember how the spelling is um, correct for each one of them. Okay? So just do your best, and I will see you a little bit later. Bye.